I think the time has finally come. She must go. Gotcha. I don't want her to go. It sounds like you're putting her down. <laughs> oh my god. I'm having like second thoughts. Now you're having second thoughts now? I'm always having second thoughts. Just do it. Alright, so it has been nine months since I did this chalkboard, which is a very long time. And I need a change in this room, and it is the start of 2021, which will hopefully be a better year, so we need something new in my room just to switch it up, I think. I think it's time. I really like this one, though. I'm sad to see her go. So the next green cap I think I'm going to do is from Polcaroso, and it is of Theo, and she's like a little, she builds like airplanes, so it's her looking at her desk, and there's like a little sketch on it. And I think it'll be really cool, and it'll be very different from this one, because this one is obviously like very colorful and spring-like, and the other one I'm going to be doing has a lot more like whites and grays and blues in it. So I think it'll work better for like winter, but I'm a little nervous because I really like having bright colors in here. So I think I just need to bite the bullet and get started. I really don't want to have to wipe this one down though, it's so pretty. Oh, it's gonna be so hard. I'm picturing you like cleaning the chalkboard like with your tears as you're actively crying. You might not be wrong. Okay, but also every time I like take down a chalkboard, I'm literally like, will I ever do anything better than this though? Just me? Okay. Um, I don't want to do this. I like how you're like, just me, as if everybody has a giant chalkboard mural in their room that they redo every year. Uh, That's like a uniquely Alexandra experience. Alright, alright, I'm gonna do it. She's officially ruined. I'm so sad. Uh. So hopefully it'll dry all nice and black and I'll have any gray streaks in it and then after that we can start sketching out the design. But now I'm going to take a break and wait for this to dry. Alright so my chalk board is all dry now so it is time to start marking out our sketch. So I have a printed version of it here and I drew a grid on it. So I can also do the same grid on here so it'll be easier to get the proportions all correct. Time to get measuring! finally up so now we can actually start sketching out the design so I'm very excited time to work on the mural today. Right now it is about 1 o'clock and I can only work until 2.30 to 3, so I'm just going to get started and see how much we can get done today. Ooh. Day three. So today I have a lot more time. It is like raining all day, so I really don't have anything else to do. So I obviously did the board yesterday and I think it turned out really good. Sometimes I struggle a little bit with like one solid color making it look like decent because with chalk it's kind of hard to like make it look smooth. And like if you're doing this on concrete, sometimes it's easier to kind of blend it with your finger, but on my chalkboard, it's actually not like the smoothest thing, so it doesn't really work that way. So I just kind of have to leave it as is. 
But so I'm going to finish up this side here, add all the other angles, and then maybe add all the stuff on the whiteboard and like all the little doodles and stuff because right now this kind of like big white thing is like very eye-catching, if you know what I mean. So let's get working. Okay, I believe it is day four of this project and I'm honestly really tired today and I came up here to start working like three hours ago and then I started playing Animal Crossing and now here we are. So I think I'm just going to try to get a little bit done today because I'm supposed to play D&D in like an hour and a half. So I'm probably just going to work until then and I'm going to try to do most of this corner if I can get around to finishing all of that. I'm just hoping like working on this and like blasting some cape pop will kind of like wake me up. This night, this night. I did make quite a bit of progress last night and I finished all the papers and I think they look really good. I still have to do the little frame up around the little bulletin board and then I can start working on this side. And then I of course still have to do Fio, which will be a process because I'm still not totally sure if I like her proportions or not. So we have a lot of work today and it is already 3 o'clock. I meant to get started on this way earlier in the day but I think I'm just going to work as long as I can again today and see what progress we make. <laughs> Sometimes we shake a little, sometimes we let it all out Or if we made a little, bet we would figure it out I don't mind me go Oh, Miss Touch turns cold Cause you got 20-20 and I don't see it straight Alrighty, back at it again. I didn't really get around to working on my mural yesterday, I was kind of busy, so I took a break. And I'm back at it again today and I really want to wrap this thing up soon it's been taking a while because I haven't had like a whole lot of designated time to work on it at one time so I think I really want to work on the background behind Fio today and try to finish most of that up filling in this um, building and all of these big panels and lines and windows is going to take a while so let's see how much I can get through today today will be the last day of working on the chalkboard. I should be able to finish it up if I work really really hard today. I just have to do the table and Theo basically. So it sounds possible, it just depends how well Theo goes. If she looks like completely unproportionate, it's going to take a while. But I have high hopes for today, so I think I should just get working on it because I'm very pumped about this. to mention it but yesterday I accidentally stepped on my ruler now she has a bend in her <sighs> time start for you I 
I know I said it yesterday, but I'm going to say it again today. Hopefully we will be finishing up the mural today. So I was super close to finishing it yesterday, but then my parents dragged me out of the house. So I had to leave it unfinished, super close, and I've been kind of going mad about it. So at least it gave me some time to kind of look at it and reflect and figure out what things kind of need fixing. So I have to figure out how to fix those, and hopefully I will finish it up very soon. I'm so tired today. Here is my newly finished mural. I'm so happy with it. I think it turned out really nice. It's just like good to switch it up from the last one, especially since this one is a little bit more muted, but I like that this table kind of brought in some colors and stuff. And I'm really happy with how it turned out. It took a very long time and obviously a ton of work, but I'm really happy with it. I just think it's a good like switch up for winter. So I'm very happy. Thanks you guys so much for watching and I hope you liked it. And I will see you guys next week. Bye. It's not the worst thing that has happened, so you still okay. Seriously though, um, when I started, this little white piece of chalk was a full stick. I went through a lot of white this project.